hello welcome to my channel today I'm going to show you how to install uh, Amazon Linux server PHP MySQL and PHP MyAdmin so first of all I connect my server through the putty because I'm using the Windows 10 so that's why and also I copy that public IP address and also I go through that key the username is ec2 dash user yeah and also the thing is that AWS already have a good documentation with that installation so it is not a big deal I show you how to use and where you can I can share that link also in my video so just copy paste and that installation so I already open a link so you can check that install the lamp web server with the amazon linux ami so it's already a good documentation with the by the amazon so i use that first first of all i just update my server yeah now that your instance is current you install the apache web server mysql and the php software package so yamp installed it's a basic command of the rpm packages so i copied that with the php 7 and mysql 5.6 server i install and also sudo because I don't want to write sudo because I already in sudo yeah chk the next you can check config list here with a copy yeah you can check that and also now I already open with a I hope it's working fine yeah the Amazon Linux already installed the PHP version if you check the PHP does B we can check that the PHP person is 7.0.30 okay so now we have to install right away I don't create a user for the FTP because I already have that key and also I change that so then we can just copy with the for the PHP info file I already show you in my terminal the PHP version but what is the name of the PHP info dot PHP you can check that PHP 0 7.0.30 I already mention is here PHP 7.0.30 and then we use for the SQL it's I don't want to remove 
because it's required for that. Yeah, services that. Now I just copy for the run MySQL SQL installation and some option you here we can check also here when it is from the root password into the current password so that is already when it is from the password is the root account you can't use a password type the current user for the password by default its root account does not have any password set press enter type y to set password yeah y for the type y to the password password is I type and remove anonymous user you type y then also the disable the remote root y remove the test database y then privilege table y now we want just stop and check config on for the Yeah, now for the PHP admin, we can use the MB string. Okay, now we just restart. Yeah, so now we can check for the MySQL. Nice. Cannot access for the SQL password we can use for that reason. downloading the PHP my admin and also that ex extracting and remove that task or is it yes Now we can start the MySQL and also now we can check yeah the URL not publicly it's forbidden PHP my admin oh sorry that is the command for the security reason it's here
yeah now we already installed and we can create a DB okay so it's so simple to use and install that the PHP MySQL and the PHP MyAdmin for the user okay so I find the filezilla I don't have filezilla so I download for the FTP uses So now I want to go to that connect through that FTP and also that yeah CH O minus R E C two does user from EC to user with the uh, HTML so I already changed the permission with AC to user and we can use that the SFTP for my site manager here is my new website I just use that the SFTP and also that key file ec 2 dash user and here is my key file and I just connect okay then I go to the bar HTML Uh, you can check that I can use that also I can download yeah download that file yeah that successfully transparent file so I can change through that uh, FTP I can upload download the file I hold the process I can I, I already shown you so how to install the PHP and MySQL and the PHP might mean and also how to use the FTP with the uh, Amazon Linux server so if you like my video please subscribe my channel and uh, thanks for watching again and also if you have any related query with this video and uh, the Amazon Linux image the AMI so you can comment out in my video thank you so much Thanks a lot. Have a great day.